as a nationalist, I basically look to Chinese history. I personally claim credit for what my Chinese people made, but basically without claiming credit for the foreign import technologies, but in, in terms of the trajectory of the development of firearms originating in China, in some manner, since the since again since the uh, since the gun was first invented in China, and it it gone about different trajectories, even with the foreign imports. In some manner, China is sort of like the great 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 grandfather as the originator of essentially the gun, because it went from China. To the rest of to to the Western world, to Central Asia, to the Western world, and then where it came back full circle, basically. One hit wonder civilization. China, the first to invent gunpowder, and the gun. In history of weapons development, you see multiple trajectories. In one trajectory. The cannon becomes of ever larger caliber, and then the cannon becomes essentially a pole cannon or handgun that is utilized by the infantrymen. What is in this slide here that we saw and took for ourselves, we took we took a picture. We didn't take the obviously. We didn't. We didn't take the artifact. Of course, uh, this is one of the first. Represents one of the first true guns made by China, with no Western, in, with no Western innovation. Later on, you're gonna see the big, a big gigantic cannon, and to the best of my knowledge, that was purchased by the Chinese Ming government. From the Portuguese and basically the foreign cannons many of them were referred to as with you know basically these monikers Hong Yi Paul red-haired cannon or red-haired barbarian cannon it goes to history it, it's an aside of history culturally apparently the um, the ancients when they encountered the uh, the foreigner uh, the Dutch or the Portuguese, uh, basically they got they got odd monikers, red-haired people, red-haired barbarians, whatever. But basically the point is the actual military history. As a Chinese, I take credit for what we Chinese invented. We, I don't take credit for what the foreign powers invented. Early true, early true Chinese indigenous gun. Indigenous Chinese gun, no Western help. No Western help. This is one of the first guns, hand, first true handgun, first true firearm ever made and it was made in China. People talk about made in China, well, guess what? The first true gun was all made in China, gunpowder and the gun. The gun, the firearm, which has a big component in Western culture, guess what? The gun is made in China. Okay, so these cannons with foreign Western technology, you don't take credit where something is made by foreigners.